Here's your word for the day from Calvary in Lake Havasu. Visit us on the web at calvaryaz.com. Good morning, Calvary. My name is Jesse. I'm the worship pastor, and I will be sharing your word for the day. Today, we continue in Colossians, and we're talking about living the new life as followers of Jesus. We've been talking about seeking the things of heaven, setting our mind on the things of heaven, putting to death our earthly sins, and living out our lives with kindness, humility, mercy, gentleness, and patience, forgiving others as Christ has forgiven us, putting on love and allowing the peace that comes from Christ to rule in our hearts. Now let's continue reading together in Colossians 3.16. Let the word of Christ dwell in you richly, teaching and admonishing one another in all wisdom, singing psalms and hymns and spiritual songs with thankfulness in your hearts to God. As followers of Jesus, it's important that we have a desire for God's word where it becomes deeply rooted and resides in our hearts. When we study and seek his word, we'll be transformed, renewed, and filled with his wisdom and hope. It is one of the ways we can grow closer to God and we'll be able to share his word and wisdom with each other, encouraging each other and holding each other accountable. Another way that we can have closeness to God is by singing worship, thanking him for all he's done in our lives. Thank him for his goodness, his forgiveness, his mercy, his grace, his peace, his kindness, his love, and his promise of eternal life with him. That is something to celebrate every day. And when we worship him in gratitude, it can completely change our heart and spirit. I love that when we worship God, we can feel his presence, we can experience his goodness, and we can be renewed in him. It is such a joy and so important for us to gather as a church weekly to worship God, to get in the word and to encourage and to pray for each other. So let's continue to choose to live a life that pleases God. Let's choose to live with thankfulness every day. There's always something to to thank God for. Let's choose to praise him always. No matter the circumstance or what is going on in our life, we can thank him and trust him completely. Calvary, have a blessed day. Thank you for listening. And we will hope to see you this weekend at one of our services. Have a great day.